We already talked about the topic Euro 7 in a previous video when the legislation draft to the Euro 7 regulation was published and we provided a summary of the key aspects and contents of the new emission standard. In April this year, the final regulation was published and received the number 2024-1257. While we are still waiting on the implementing acts that contain the detailed and technical description of the testing procedures, we can still extract the main contents of the new emission standard, including the new emission limits. For the light vehicles, Euro 7 shall apply from 29th of November 2026 for the new type approvals and then one year later for the new vehicles. And for the heavy vehicles and trailers, Euro 7 shall apply from the 29th of May 2028, again for the new type approvals and then one year later for the new vehicles. And for the small volume manufacturers, there's even some additional time until they have to comply with the new Euro 7 standard. In general, Euro 7 can be described as an evolutionary step to Euro 6, including some additional aspects like onboard monitoring, over-the-air communication, non-exhaust emissions like tire aberration and brake particles, and battery durability. We as TÜV Süd are a designated technical service at several European approval authorities and of course offer our service to you as a manufacturer. If you want to learn more, please feel free to reach out to us. And as always, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and see us next time.